Sometimes you would like to quote someone else in an article that you're writing or quote someone else in something that you're actually doing. And obviously always make sure to credit your sources, but sometimes you would like to be able to take and just highlight and copy text. So you do what you normally do, you highlight it, you copy it, and you paste it into, for example, Microsoft Word. Only once it's pasted, it comes with all this funny formatting. There's you know, spaces in between here, and it looks like this has a really tall paragraph line, and you know, there's all kinds of funny stuff in here, not to mention these links are still there, you know, to actually follow back to those different links on the page. So instead, what you can do is actually take this exact same text, and you can copy it into Notepad. Now, where do you find Notepad on your computer? Well, you go Start, you go down to the little Start button in the corner, and then choose what you want. Then you go start and go all programs. All programs will pop up this menu and inside of the menu is accessories and inside of accessories is notepad. So you can actually select notepad and inside of notepad then just copy your text. So again you can right click here and go paste it right in. Okay now you'll see it's kind of just put it all on one line but highlight all of it. Go copy and now it's copied from Notepad as opposed to being copied from online. And let's say you go and put it into Microsoft Word at this point. Well now it's much easier to actually have it in here. There's little spaces and things that maybe you have to correct, but that's about it. It's much easier than trying to edit this into what you want it to be. The possible applications for this are varied. It's just really helpful to be able to remove the pre-formatted stuff if you need to be able to do that. So I hope this has been helpful. Use Notepad. It's pretty simple. There's also a lot of other programs out there that you can use. You may find links to some of them on this page, either in the comments or we might be posting some after this video has been posted after people make some suggestions. Basically, you know, use Notepad or another text editor program that will allow you to remove the formatting. Thank you for visiting us today at TellMeHowToDoThis.com.